Welcome to 2K Sports. We have the NBA coming up. Great to have you with us. Hello, everyone. I'm Brian Anderson, joined by Grant Hill and Clark Kellogg. We'll hear from reporter Ali LaForce in a moment. We've got the Lakers taking on the Los Angeles Lakers. Here we go. Tip-off goes to the Lakers. Here are the five for the Lakers. Outside Johnson. Pass to Worthy. They swipe it. Here's West. Poke loose. Here's Baylor. Here's Barnett. Clock at six. From deep. Nick Barnett. Now Los Angeles with it. It's a three-point game. Right side Johnson. Pass to Worthy. And out of bounds, Los, Los Angeles, Angeles will have it. First quarter, just over a minute play. Here's Baylor. Takes one from 10 feet. And yep, it's good. Sometimes it's simple. Put the ball in the hands of your scorers and let them do what they do best. Knocked away. It's an even three-on-three -three break. Here's Barnett. It's rebounded by Divac. A rare miss for him at point-blank range. That's one he'd like to have back. Pass to Johnson. Here's Scott. Nice start for him. Sinking his first shot. I'll tell you what, the peripheral vision, the court awareness of Johnson, this guy always knows when one of his teammates is open. Here's West, covered by Johnson. Here's Nelson. The shot that time, not on target. And Los Angeles the other way now. Here's Worthy. And there's the drive. And the layup is good off the glass. Just taking it right to the rim. And no one was there to greet him. Well, this early, they should be showing a lot more energy on defense. It's not there. Here's West. Here in the first, just under two and a half minutes played so far. Baylor. Yeah, an explosive oh, athlete, Baylor. the precursor to the high flyers, prone to the spectacular Baylor with the strong move. Here's Worthy. Left side, Johnson. Five to shoot. And hitting from the mid-range here and early. I mean, gives the defense just another thing to worry about. Well, they better be thinking about him. I mean, we know how dangerous he is. Pass to West. Inside. The Lakers trail. Just under three and a half minutes elapsed here in the first quarter. it inside. He's in his comfort zone. Two for two to start this one. I love the execution we are seeing thus far. Four shots and four makes. Pass to Baylor. The 15-footer. Offensive board. Blocked! Here's LaRusso. No luck. They battled on the glass, but they couldn't knock it down. Here's Scott. Now here's Johnson. Three shots, three baskets. Great efficiency so far. Yeah, watching Johnson exert his will down low now, using his height and quick release quite well inside. Pass to Baylor. Over to the wing. Here's West. Shot clock at six. 
Down low. Baylor, that's good. He's got six. Nice start as he's knocked down three of his first four and has hit the ground at high speed. Out to the right wing. Back to Johnson. Pass to Scott. Beyond the arc. LaRusso grabs the miss. And, you know, even though that shot didn't go down, I, I like how they got him a wide open look in space there. Here's West. Oh, nice finish from the low block. That one's good. And, and you know, a tough, crafty score inside. West showing you he's not just an elite jump shooter. And here's Johnson. Six points for him. Here's Scott. Out to the right wing. Here's T-Box. Off the mark with the outside fadeaway. He just couldn't finish the job that time. And too bad, because it was a nice look. Here's Barnett. Over to the left wing. Here's West, covered by Johnson. Gets a hand on it. It's good on the putback. Now Los Angeles with it. Trailing by five. Pass to Worthy. Back to Johnson. From 13. And it comes off the front of the rim. More often than not, he'll cash it in from that area. The defense might have done just enough to bother him. Here's West, covered by Johnson. And the basket by West. Six points for him. The D hasn't been quick enough to react to the ball inside. That's helped cause this run. Here's Scott. And you can count it. He'll go to the line with a chance at a three-point play. Good execution. They're getting some short-range looks here. And the Lakers making a change here. Green is checked in. King, he's checked in for the Lakers. One shot. And that one misses. The Lakers in the lead. Pass to LaRusso. To the wing on the left. Here's West, covered by Johnson. From 17. No good off the back of the rim. Good shot, gone bad. Gotta finish there. Here's Worthy, knocked loose. To the inside, here's Green. Good setup. Led him to the rack perfectly for the layup. Such confidence as a passer. Hits guys in stride, it makes it look easy. Out left to the wing. Pass to Baylor. Here's West, covered by Johnson. The Russo. That one falls. He's now one for three. And he gives up some size inside, but makes a great adjustment on the finish. Yeah, you know, with that size difference, that's not an easy shot. I mean, I don't care how close to the rim he is. That's a tough shot. Now here's Johnson. Six points for him. The offensive rebound. Second chance effort. The shot comes out. Here's King. He takes it in, and is blocked. And that'll be Los Angeles' ball as it goes out of bounds. Lakers able to keep the possession. And now another look at that mobile one block defensive performance. Yeah, I love that they maintain the defensive energy even when they're behind. Thompson, he's checked in for the Lakers. Puts it up off the inbound. Oh, and Johnson with a block. Tell you what, the long arms and great wingspan of Johnson. 
Johnson well used and suited for the shot tonight. Now here's Johnson. Pass to Scott. Down to five on the shot clock. Thompson. And that's good. His first bucket of the game. <laughs> they are passing the ball around tremendously right now. Here's West, covered by Johnson. Here's West. Six points for him. Ooh, hard work creating the second chance opportunity. The Lakers trail. Outside Johnson. That's tipped. Here's West. Up and in on the layup. And now it's a seven-point Los Angeles lead. And an important part of every team's game. A look at the hustle stats for the Lakers. Boy, they've really amped up the pressure at the defensive end, guys, and have piled up the steals in the early going. They're also jumping on a lot of turnovers and making sure they turn them into points at the other end. I love how they've attacked the boards here in the first quarter. Yeah, I like the way they're setting the tone. They're really playing with a lot of energy here at the start. That one goes in. 12 points for him. Just so successful getting the ball inside and finding those great looks. Outside Johnson. Fires the three. Rebounded by West. There's a minute 34 left in the first quarter to the paint. And that one's good. Russo. Yeah, their defense is starting to wear down. That's three straight buckets at the rim. Things just don't seem to be clicking for them offensively. Yeah, they really need to find a way to get back on track. Outside Johnson. Pass to Green. Here's Scott. 6 to shoot. Worthy. They need this. And the layup is good. And once more this half, they find a way to get great position inside. Here's West, covered by Johnson. There's 49 seconds left now in the first quarter. Out of bounds, it'll be Lakers ball. To the lineup for your Lakers, Larry Green. Here's Worthy. 36 seconds left to play in the first quarter, and can't connect on that one. His first miss. He's two of three now. Pass to Nelson. Here's Baylor. Inside. And count that. Two points and a chance for one more at the line. They just look so overwhelmed inside. Yeah, that's why they continue to get attacked. Yeah, I think they've got to ramp up the aggressiveness. If they don't, things are just going to get worse from here. Here's Worthy. Here's Drew. Four seconds left. With one on the clock. No good on the layup. And an overpowering first quarter effort. Already a double digit advantage. The Lakers on top. They lead by 12. And back to the start of the second quarter in just a moment. It's been a lopsided game. 
we'll see if that changes here in the second. And for the Lakers, this has been the game they wanted to have. That's <laughs> simple. Offensively, they limited their turnovers. Defensively, they forced turnovers. Yeah, I like the way they forced a ton of turnovers and then took advantage of those turnovers with opportunistic baskets. On the court for the Lakers. And just a great job of getting there first and absorbing the contact. No question about it. No flop there. That was a direct shot to the chest. Here's Scott. Pass to Worthy. Here's Campbell. And out of bounds, Los Angeles will have it. Well, that's a moment he'd like to archive. Embarrassing lapse of judgment there. And the Lakers making a change here. with a rebound. Here's Worthy. Pass to Drew. To the middle. Here's Campbell. Just over a minute gone here in the second quarter. Can't hit that one. Here's Baylor. Inside. Here's LaRusso. Oh, and he blocks it off the glass. Wow. Here's Scott, right wing. Here's Worthy. Here's Campbell. And good work on the boards as they picked up the second chance points. That'll drive your coach crazy, failing to box out. Ugh. Those are free points you're giving away. You've got to work harder on the glass. Here's King. Laker foul. A.C. Green. Now to the lineup for your Lakers, Sam Perkins. Pass to West. Here's King. Five to shoot. Here's Baylor. 12 points for him. And the shot goes. 14 points for him. And just not letting up at all. I mean, you have to love this approach. You want to get the ball to the guys who make plays. If it's working, keep working it. That's what I say. Keep the pressure on them. Here's Worthy. Here's Drew. Here's Scott. And the deficit down inside single digits. You must respect the jump shot of Byron Scott. I mean, elevates as soon as he gets the pass. And he's got a nice lift on that jump shot, which makes it hard to block. Excellent as a catch-and-shoot guy. Here's Baylor. Here's LaRusso. Doesn't go that time. And it's the Lakers the other way. Pass to Drew. Tries it from 16. Nice spin off the left rim and in. Quarter number two in around three minutes gone by. Here's West. Give him eight. Here's Scott to the inside. Worthy. Got to give him credit for jumping on the ball and making the most at the other end. Boy, inexcusable at this point of the game. They got to be more composed in these moments. Exactly. I mean, when you're running neck to neck, those kinds of mistakes tip the skid. Here's West. Here's Barnett. Oh, no good. The dry spell continues. Here's Scott. Rebound by Baylor. That's going up against a defense that knows your tendencies. Pass to King. Here's West. Yeah, 
to the paint. Here's Baylor. He's getting it done offensively, making winning plays at every turn. The Lakers trail. Timeout called. The Lakers. Adjustments are a part of every game and every quarter of a game. I think Coach sees something here. And you know what? We'll see what changes he makes coming out of this timeout. And so it's the Lakers with it. Their defense has only allowed four points in the quarter. Pass to Worthy. To the left side wing. Five on the clock. Here's Drew. Here's Divac. Offensive rebound. Good on the bucket. Excellent activity and timing on the offensive glass. That's how you get extra possessions. Pass to West. Here's Barnett. Here's West. Give him eight points now. Here's Baylor. The shot misses. And it's the Lakers the other way. Here's Drew. Picked his pocket. Here's Barnett. Goes to the reverse layup and drops it in. Five points in the game. His nimbleness makes him a unique threat at the rim. Pass to Scott. Here's Worthy. Six points for him. Six on the shot clock. Here's Scott. Not enough on that one as it misses. The Lakers in the lead to the left wing. Baylor, that's good. Seems like he can't miss right now, guys. I mean, completely in the zone this quarter. Here's Drew. Pass to Worthy. And he gets it to go. Four for six so far. Defensively, you just can't afford to give these easy looks up. You're just asking to get burned if you do. To the right side. Here's Barnett. Here's West. Give him eight points now. Barnett can't hit. You know, guys, you can tell he wants to contribute more, but his teammates have picked up the slack for him. That's what being on the team is all about. Here's Scott. Seven points in the game. Well, guys, they need to do something to reduce this deficit. We'll see if that's the answer. Here's King. Oh, and makes it with the kiss. And the Lakers lead by nine. Good play call and good execution. The offense running on all cylinders. Here's Drew. Pass to Worthy. The Lakers with a rebound. Here's King, out to the wing. Here's West. Here's King. And they turn it over. Shot clock violation is the buzzer sounds. Thompson, he's checked in for the Lakers. Johnson comes in for Scott. Here's Drew. Pass to Johnson. Here's Drew. Let's go with a three. Sinks the tray. Five points in the game. Defensively, there was a lack of aggressiveness, and it really made it easy for him to knock that shot down. To the wing on the left. 
13 feet out. The putback controls the rebound and the putback. The effort, the position, the timing, all there. And add instincts to that. He can sense where the rebound's going to go. And that sixth sense, guys, might be better than just about anybody else. Here's Drew following the score by the Lakers. Pass to Dibot. LaRusso grabs the miss. And they're doing strong work on the glass. A plus five advantage for them. And guys, you know that rebounding is a huge part, a huge component of winning games. It's not a glamour stat, but it's necessary if you're going to be a winning team. Oh, he hangs in there and cashes in on the second chance points. They have no answer defensively inside. Yeah, and that's four straight field goals now they've allowed from point blank range. Can't happen. Now here's Johnson. Six points for him. Down low. Here's d -Bots. And it's in after a nice bounce off the right iron. You know, that's how you do it, guys. I mean, he passed his way out of the double team and into an easy basket. Pass to Baylor. Here's LaRusso. 11 points in the game. Here's Baylor, covered by Johnson. Just five to shoot. From deep three-point range, and they force the shot clock violation. Great D. And the Lakers making a change here. Green is checked in. A.C. Green. The Lakers trail. Johnson with it. Pass to Green. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. At the line for Los Angeles, A.C. Green. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. No good on the free throw. He hits the second from the line. 152 left in the first half. Here's Baylor. He's got 18. Pass to LaRusso. Here's King, covered by Johnson. Just four to shoot. Here's Barnett. Rebounded by Green. Well, he has not been sharp this period. Seems to be a little flustered out there, too. And a strong finish with two hands. Oh, strong finish to cut into that lead a little. And left no doubt with that one, Grant. Well, I tell you what, he loaded up as much power as he could behind that two hand. Here's Barnett. He's got five. To the middle. Here's Baylor. And the layup is good after a nice lead pass. Give him 20. Well, I tell you what, once Baylor gets into a groove the way he has tonight, he can absolutely carry the load on offense. Here's Johnson. And that bucket makes him four for seven today. Good production. Wow, he really fires up his team with his ability to extend possessions. The Lakers in the lead to the left wing. Here's Baylor. Here's LaRusso. And that one's good. Rudy nice job LaRusso. on the glass as they picked up two on the second effort. No defensive pressure at all. I mean, that's not going to get it done against him. It's Johnson with a drive. Shot's no good. Made four. He's missed four now. Now Los Angeles with it. They held a 12-point lead earlier. Here's King, covered by Johnson. Inside. 
Here's Drew. Oh, no good on the last second attempt there. And so it's the Los Angeles Lakers closing out this quarter with a seven-point lead. Their key to consistency has been their dominance in the paint. They've been the more physical team. We'll be back in a moment. And now, the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Hello, basketball fans. What a pleasure it is to bring you into the 2K studios again. Ernie Johnson, Shaquille O'Neal, Kenny the Jet Smith. The Lakers came ready to play. They led by as many as 12 points, fueled by tough defense and great offense. They were sitting on top with a 12-point lead at the end of the first quarter. Second quarter, not quite as good, but still managed to maintain control and enjoy a seven-point advantage at the break. Shaq, what do you think about the Lakers? What stood out to me more than anything else was how hard they got after it on the offensive glass. They were keeping possessions alive and converting those rebounds into points. Take away those extra points, they're not in this position, right? And Kenny, let's get your thoughts on the Lakers. They wouldn't be in such a deep hole if they hadn't given up so many offensive rebounds. Getting out hustled, getting moved around, losing possession. The one thing you can control is effort. And that should do it. With the second half about to begin, let's send you back to Kevin Harlan. Go back to Kevin Harlan. Go. Just go over there. And if you're just joining in, one half is in the books. One half to go. On offense, here are the Lakers. They lead by seven. Here's West, covered by Johnson. Johnson with the defensive effort. And for the Lakers, pass to Worthy. Back to Johnson. Shot clock at five. And he scores it. Now five of nine for the field. That's simply an outstanding play, working the size mismatch right at the rim. And for Los Angeles. Right wing. Here's Nelson. To the paint. Here's West. It falls. Five for 11 in the game. <laughs> a great move. I mean, the defense has no response. Yeah, if that's a harbinger of things to come, he's looking at having a very big second half. Here's Worthy. Pass to Scott. To the inside. Here's Divac. Got it. Good job in the low post. He has six. It's very difficult to slow him down defensively, especially when you have communication problems. Here's Barnett. He's got five. Here's LaRusso. From 11 feet away, connects. The jumper drops. And the Lakers lead by seven. Credit the plays they're calling for. Getting him right now some good shots. Pass to Worthy. Good. And that makes him six for nine. A quality game for him so far. So far, so good to begin this half. They're three for three. Perfect. Here's Barnett. A little under two and a half minutes gone by in the third quarter. Here's West. The Lakers with a rebound. Here's Worthy. Pass to Scott. Into the lane. Oh, and that one, no question. Powered it down. Making sure of it with the two-hand slam, B.A. Yeah, I don't blame him. With the score this tight, you cannot take a chance here. I get the feeling, guys, that he may be sensing that this is a critical time in this game. Here's Baylor. 20 points for him. Here's West. 
Set it up with a fake, but it's offline. The Lakers trail. Here's Worthy. A little under three and a half minutes off the clock now in the third quarter. Here's Johnson. Pass to Scott. From the strike. No good that time. And that's their first miss after hitting four in a row to start the half. Looking to get back on track. Can't get it to drop. Johnson with the defensive effort. Man, miss after miss for him. When you're having a quarter like this, the only beneficiary is the defense. Here's Scott. Nine points in the game. Left side, Johnson. And he was fouled in the act of shooting. Opportunity for a three-point play here. And I say, hey, if it keeps working, go to it. Stay with it. I mean, until the defense responds and provides more resistance, keep making them pay. And let's get your take, guys, on the scoring breakdown for the Lakers. They haven't been pushed around in the paint at all in this game. They've been the aggressors. You know, something else I've noticed is just how many of their baskets have been set up by assists throughout the game. And it's the Lakers ball. Down low. Oh, they need this. Can't get the layup. Here's the steal. Here's West, covered by Johnson. Pass to Baylor. That one's good for two. 22 points for him. Woo, just selling the defense on the pump fake. And it's the Lakers' ball. Their defense is only allowed six points in the second half. Here's Campbell. Another shot. The Lakers with a rebound. Here's LaRusso. 15 points in the game. And a foul called on the way up. So he'll take two from the free throw line. You know, the power and grace of Elgin Baylor, just too much to handle. This time he draws the foul. For the Lakers. Elgin Baylor. Shooting two. The first one falls. That's good as he hits both shots. This is why you want ball movement and player movement. And that's made it hard for the defense to key in on any one individual. Here's Perkins. LaRusso grabs the miss. Here's Barnett. Five points in the game. Pass to Baylor. Here's Barnett. Just five on the clock. On the take. It's deflected. Outside Johnson. The defense takes a chance, leaves him open at the mark, and he capitalizes. Here's Barnett. Pass to LaRusso. It falls again. He's now 8 for 12 from the floor. The defense couldn't collapse quickly enough. Now here's Johnson. He's got 16. Here's Scott. Barnett with a rebound. He just can't find a consistent way to score. And this team could certainly use it. 
Here's Baylor. 24 points for him. Carries it down low. 26 points for him. That's a textbook example of how to move the ball. Boy, you gotta love that action. Time called here. Los Angeles decides to talk it over. And something fans don't always get to see, some of the closely guarded secrets that happen in that huddle. Yeah, typically there's some type of adjustment made out of a timeout. It might be major, or it could be just a slight tweak. checked in and so it's the Lakers with it it's a five-point game here's Scott nine points in the game from the right block Johnson passes to Thompson here's Scott can't connect from 13 feet out you gotta love how they've been crashing the boards Fighting hard for every miss. I certainly do. You know I like to see guys do their work inside. Their rebounding has been excellent, and that's always important in a close game. Now Los Angeles with it. Pass to Worthy. Green with the ball. Here's Worthy. Thompson right side. Here's Scott. The Lakers with another miss. Yeah, you know, they're losing in large part because he's, he's not playing well. It's really as simple as that. Here's West. Here's LaRusso. That shot missing. And the Lakers will go the other way with it. Outside Johnson. Here's Worthy. 12 points for him. A shot to stop the drought. The shot by Johnson, no good. The Lakers in the lead. Here's King. Over to the left wing. Pass to West. Banked it in off the glass. 12 points for him. Want to score in the NBA? Picks can really force the D to make tough choices. Outside Johnson. And he was fouled while in the act of shooting. So he'll take two free throws. And Johnson is an elite talent, a special talent. A very unique point guard with amazing size. About 6'9". He can flat out take over games because he virtually can play every position. down the first one and the Lakers making a change here and Johnson drops them both free throw shooting is about mechanics confidence and your mental approach he's locked in from there most every night. Here's West. He's got 12. To the wing, right side. Looking to end this cold spell. They get it again. The shot's good. 19 points in the game. 
and they just continue to dominate the boards. Guys, I think they've simply been the more physical team, and that's why they're ahead. Now here's Johnson. He's got 18. Here's Drew. The putback. Great positioning on the putback. Yeah, it's pretty cool watching Thompson use his length on the boards. I mean, he does an excellent time job out, out. anticipating where misses are going. Time called here. Los Angeles decides to talk it over. Here's Barnett. He's got five. Out to the right wing. Here's West. Green covering. And the basket by West. 14 points for him. I mean, they've been relentless. Just keep getting shots at the rim. Well, the defensive rotations have been a step slow, and it's really helped them get that ball inside time after time. From 13, and the shot no good. A bit short. The Lakers trail. Now Johnson. Driving inside. Here's Green. And another shot. Oh, swiped away. Here's Barnett. Tipped. Here's Drew. And there's a three-second violation. Los Angeles ball. And we've got to see that sensational mobile one block again. Yeah, just some terrific effort there. And you know the whole team will get an energy boost off a block like that one. A minute 20 left to play in the third quarter. Pass to LaRusso. Rebounded by Green. Green's got six rebounds in the game. Here's Scott. The Lakers with a rebound. They held a 12-point lead earlier. The way he's struggling this quarter, he's only adding to their troubles. They need his offense to come around. Outside Johnson. Pass to Drew. 40 seconds left in the third. Here's t -Bot. And the bucket is good. And here are the Lakers. Leading by five. Fires at the elbow. West misses. Really good job on the inside that time. I mean, he had to work for that rebound. He got it done. Johnson with a bucket. Yeah, he's owning them on the offensive end, but, you know, he can't do it by himself. Here's West. He's got 14. Off target with the shot. It's still anybody's game as we reach the end of three. Lakers ahead, leading by three. We've got more NBA basketball coming your way in just a minute. still anybody's ball game. On the court for the Lakers to start the fourth. Johnson with a bucket. Johnson's got 22. It's winning time, and that's a winning play. Here's West. Driving to the basket. It's stolen by Green. Knocks it loose. Fast break. Here come the Lakers. Here's West. To the left side wing.
Here's Barnett. Clock at six. Uses the glass to finish the layup. And the Lakers lead by three. 60 ticks off the clock here in the fourth. Pass to Divac. 13 feet out. He can't get it to go. And it's the Lakers the other way. Inside. Here's Barnett. The basket drops. And he gets fouled on the shot. One free throw coming his way. Honestly, I don't know how he pulled that off. And that was not a soft foul he had to get to. I mean, he had to really power that one up and in. And here's Johnson. That's worthy. Here's Scott. Here he goes. That shot off the mark. Over to the wing. Here's Barnett. Green covering. Here's Baylor. Rebound, the Lakers. Johnson's got six rebounds here tonight. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. At the line for the Lakers, Magic Johnson. Free throw drops for Johnson. And they've done well from the free throw line this half. No misses yet. And that efficiency, as you know, so critical when you're looking to overcome a deficit. You've got to be close to perfect and can't waste scoring opportunities. And Johnson drops them both. He couldn't get to the line once in the first half. Coach must have really talked to him at the break. Pass to Baylor. Here's LaRusso. To the middle. Here's King. He's off on that one. Johnson with the defensive effort. And you know, even though they're on top, they're winning. I mean, they could use more from him. They're trying to shut the door on this one to the paint. Here's Perkins. And you want him taking good shots at this point in the game. And that one was easy. Well, you don't want to give him any open shots at this stage. Never mind a layup. Come on now. My goodness. Pass to King. Yeah, if you're just joining us, fourth quarter here. We're just over two and a half minutes into it. Baylor. LaRusso. Nice persistence to tip it back in. He's got 21. Real smooth, guys. Great job with the tip in. Those are the kind of plays on the offensive glass that can tell you a lot about a player. Yes, they can. They can't allow him to beat them to too many more of those. Time called here. Los Angeles decides to talk it over. Yeah, Coach, no doubt, wants to use this timeout to review the matchups and maybe make some adjustments as well. And I agree. I think there's going to be a new wrinkle in their game plan when they come out of this timeout. All right, let's check in with Allie LaForce. I had a chance to find out what Los Angeles' coach was going over with his guys. He told them this is a game that we can win. It's a game we should win. We've matched those guys step for step. From this point forward, let's try to force them to play at our tempo. Thank you for that, Allie. Here's LaRusso, five on the clock. A bit under three and a half minutes have passed here in the fourth, and it's King missing. Pass to Johnson. Here's Worthy. 
Here's Divac. From deep, Johnson. Rebound, the Lakers. They held a 12-point lead earlier. Here's King, covered by Johnson. Here's LaRusso. Not going to go that time. The Lakers trail. Left side, Johnson. He takes it in to tie it up. Here's the second effort, and he sinks the layup. Johnson's got 28 points for the game. They've really picked up the energy level and have willed themselves back into this game. Yeah, you know, battling back is about staying the course, and their attitude never changed. Here's Baylor. Here's Barnett. Pass to King. Oh, it's stolen. Here's Worthy. Here's Scott. Goes up and lays it in nice and easy. And the Lakers lead by two. Nice job hitting him right in stride. Excellent play. Out left to the wing. Trying to get back on track. And it's Baylor missing. Pass to Scott. To the middle. Picked it out of midair. Going all the way to the rack. The rebound by Baylor. Going inside. Pass to King. Here's Nelson. And it's Baylor missing. Here's Worthy. I just love the aggressive finish. Now, I'm thinking he's sending a strong message with that jam. That's exactly how you send it. Two hands and down. Out to the wing. Here's Baylor. Here's LaRusso. They shoot again. And the layup is up and in. Give him 23. At this stage of the game, the offensive rebounding and putback is massive. It feels like a four-point swing. Yeah, you really do because those extra possessions, when they lead to points, that's huge. I mean, he did a nice job there. Never gave up on the play. And you know my motto, persistence pays dividends. And really strong at the line since the break. No misses yet. You can't do much better than that, guys. And guys, what do you think about the hustle stats for Los Angeles? Oh, their defense has been outstanding. Closing out on shots and blocking quite a few as well. They've been firing on all cylinders in the transition game, too. I mean, they've really run the break well. Two shots. The first one falls. And, you know, Divaka, really unique big man. Not only a, a good scorer, but an incredible passer for a guy his size. So he gets them both. The Lakers trail. Pass to Nelson. Here's Baylor. Here's Barnett. And it's Perkins with a rebound. No excuses, none. I mean, with the defense non-existent, I mean, he has to connect from there. And here's Johnson. Let's it go from deep. He can't get that one to fall. Now the Lakers take it the other way. Here's Barnett. Pass to King. Over to the left wing. Here's Baylor. Here's King. Covered by Johnson. Here's King. That one doesn't drop. 
Yet yeah, that's another miss for him. They're behind in this game largely because he shot so poorly. Outside Johnson takes it inside. Second shot opportunity. And hooking for two. Here's King. They need something good to happen here. Yeah, they've gone way too long without a score. Here's Baylor. Oh, and Johnson with a block. They get it back. Here's LaRusso. Rebounded by Johnson. Johnson's got nine rebounds in the game. Boy, he's getting it done. The teardrop. No luck on that one. Here's Barnett. Pass to King. Here's Barnett. Here's LaRusso. Shot clock at six. King gets the bucket. King. Really nice job moving the ball around that time, picking apart that defense. Now Los Angeles with it. They're on a 16-6 run. Drives to the hoop. Scott. Rebound by the Lakers. I wonder if switching baskets really threw him off. I mean, because he can't get anything to fall this half. Pass to Baylor. A shot from the low post is good. And now it's just a two-point Laker lead. And this is just typical of him. Always making an impact at crucial moments in the game. You know, they want the ball in his hands here because they trust him to hit all the big shots. Oh, yes, the turnaround. Johnson's got 10 points in the quarter. Well, he's demanding the ball. He wants it, and he's coming through. I mean, you can see why his teammates trust him down the stretch, guys. Time called here. The Lakers decide to talk it over. You could really see his squad was losing steam. Smart timeout to give him a brief. And now we present our New Balance Player of the Game. Think about this. He has owned this game from start to finish. Wow. So impressive. The defense literally looked helpless trying to stop him out there. He has been far and away the best player on the court, and it's not close. And the Lakers with possession here. Trailing by four. Pass to Baylor. Here's West. Six to shoot. Tries to break his ice. Rebounded by Green. Green's got his eighth rebound here tonight. Here's Worthy. The ball's knocked loose. Here's the break. Here's West. And this was already coming down to the wire, but poor ball control and some fast hands have raised the stakes. The Lakers call timeout. A minute 53 left in the game. Left side, Johnson. And the layup falls. Johnson's got 12 now in this quarter. Pulling no punches, attacking the heart of that defense. Here's Baylor. 133 left in the fourth quarter. Six on the shot clock. Pass to Baylor. Shoots from 12. He hits the back iron and sinks it. 30 points in the game. Hey, draw him up a solid play. Get him an open look. And he delivers. Yeah, I put that one on the defense. I mean, they can't leave him open at this stage. Now here's Johnson. Here's Scott. Good. And Los Angeles the other way now. Pass to West. 50 seconds left in the fourth quarter here. Here's Baylor. Ooh, can't tie it up as that one's no good. Here's 
is worthy. Inside. Green, the pass to Johnson. Catch! Talk about stepping up in a big way. Well, that was one, too. He wanted the ball. Nobody else was taking that shot. Time called here. Los Angeles decides to talk it over. They're trailing by four. 29 seconds left in the final quarter. on D. Four-point game. And he got the whistle on the way up. So he'll be headed to the line for a pair. <laughs> so close on the finish. I mean, it could have been a three-point opportunity. Full throttle, pedal to the metal, attacking basketball. I like that. Shoot two. Gets the first, and that narrows the lead down to just three. And so he makes both from the line. And he doesn't let the pressure get to him. Cool and confident from the line. The Lakers call timeout. They're leading by two. 27 seconds left to play in the fourth. Three second difference between the shot clock and the game clock. And now they decide to foul intentionally. Twenty six seconds left to play in the fourth and they go to the intentional foul. At the line for Los Angeles, Good on the first and that makes it a three point lead. hits both free throws here and it's a four-point ball game coming up clutch there at the line making it a two possession game and right here they can't waste any time no you need a quick bucket and then a quick pop here's Baylor count it oh, sees his man threads the pass inside excellent teamwork and they foul intentionally that's what they have to do at this point yeah you know you had to do that I mean you can't allow them to dribble out the top exactly I mean, Got to stop the clock any way possible and hope they alligator arm a few of those free throws. So the first one drops, and that makes it a three point lead. Second one is good, getting both at the line. And it's a four-point ball game. Pass to LaRusso. Launches it. And Worthy pulls it down. And they need to stop the clock, so there's the foul. Oh, At the line for the Lakers, Magic Johnson. He drops the first one, and that puts him up five. So 
he goes two for two at the line, and it's a six-point ball game. When you've got your opponent down, don't let him up. This one's all but over. Off on that one. So we see the Lakers get the win here. Boy, a hard-fought game. They did a great job of holding on to the lead at the end. Yeah, get the coffee, because that's the way to close. You're going to face some obstacles in the game, but they overcame every one. For Grant Hill, Clark Kellogg, and Ali LaForce, this is Brian Anderson thanking you for watching. We'll see you next time.